Well, most of my primary school education was in the States and this was in the early 50s and at that time uh, the American system was very sort of project oriented so um, we would uh, work on particular project themes and the idea was to bring all the subjects into that. So that, that got me into the idea of being interested in finding out about particular things. And it's reinforced by the fact that my mother, who was a French teacher but didn't work um, in paid employment after we were born, was also get interested in um, some particular uh, things, let's say stimulated by a talk she'd been to or something she'd read and uh, would find out about uh, uh, in more depth about it and tell us about what she was finding out about. Well, when I was at Oxford I had a degree in maths, and it was maths, maths and more maths, and I was more interested in applying maths to other questions, and in my last year we were advised to go to the careers office, and the guy that uh, gave the careers advice sat there in a hairy sports jacket, puffing a pipe, and his advice was, there were two um, things open. Either you could become a maths teacher and there was a great shortage of maths teachers, in which case you should go and see his colleague downstairs. And um, I was didn't have the confidence that I would be able to teach uh, maths at school level to people who didn't like maths and couldn't understand it. Um, uh, the other op option was a work on a missile called Blue Streak. When I said I wasn't very interested in Blue Streak, the career advisor asked me if I'd been on any of the Order Master marches, and I said yes. And he said, I don't like you people, you don't wash, and blew some more pipe smoke over me. In fact, uh, Blue Streak was cancelled the following year. So I, I decided to explore other avenues. 